Hello. Did, what? You, hear, did you hear about um, true story? There was an exotic cat rescued from a tree in Ohio. Uh huh. Tested positive for cocaine. Sounds like a great Friday. Naughty pussy. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions of Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks to Patreon. Follow us to account, subscribe and the like button. Today, we got a video. This is top eight Bollywood stars you didn't know were child actors. Do you know who is a child actor? I'm your con. Rick. I am. Uh, I started acting at four years old. Got my SAG card at four years old. And they are ungrateful and didn't let you go to the SAG. They place. really did. I called and asked if I could go because it's my 50th year as a SAG member. And they said, no. No, one year you missed your dues. You can't. <laughs> no, sorry. We don't care that you've been there for 50 years. Do something creatively worthy of an award, and then we'll let you come to the show, you idiot. Exact quote? Just like that. Wow. Straight from there. And then they said, and by the way, your dues are late. So you need to... No, I'm just kidding. They did. So. Today uh, is that video. So, but this Amir from... Khan, uh, Sri Devi. Yes. Um, didn't Rithik start as a kid? Yes. Yes, he did. Um, uh, a couple of the Kapoors. Ren Beer. Yeah. He was in stuff, right? And it, uh, his dad is Grandpa in that classic we saw that yeah. had... Yeah, 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 yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Did Alia, was she a child actor? Uh, technically. Wow, well, because... No, I'm, I, think I mean, it, I think I, it's more they kid. mean little kids. I think it's more little kid than, than teenager. Yeah, so... So let's see. Uh, anyways, uh, I'm sure we're gonna miss uh, some. Go. Oh, Titan Refuse Productions. We've seen a lot of videos from them. They're great. Uh, great channel. He does great reviews and um, uh, great videos. So, go subscribe to him. Do, 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 do. What am I doing? This. And if I remember, I've had people ask me this before. I'll let you know what I think about whether or not you should let your child be a child actor. Cool. <laughs> We think of any kind of profession, be it a corporate nine to five job or great an actor. artistic field like actor. Another great actor. We have this notion that a person only dwells into it fully after they turn 18. The surprising feature of some extremely well-known celebrities today is that they experience sets, camera crews, and acting cues what a great from a set. very young age. Yeah. Discussing yeah. exactly this, here is Tried and Refused Productions with eight Bollywood stars you did not know were child actors. We'll see about that. Number eight goes to Imran Khan. I, I did the not know that. Who nowadays is busy with married life and raising babies, made his adult acting debut with the super hit Jane Tu Ya Jane Na. The actor had one of the best debuts with the movie and later came in only some noteworthy performances like Delhi Belly, I Hate Love Stories and Matru Ki Bijli Ka Mandola. The actor's career has not really panned out the way he would want but little known fact is that he was a child actor and he starred as a younger Amir Khan in both those movies that he starred in. <laughs> he came in the 1988 Kayamat Se Kayamat and in the 1992 Jo Jita Wohi Sikandar. Number seven goes to Jugal Hansraj. I don't even know who that is. I don't know who that is. <laughs> his performance in Kahani 2 has proven to the audience and critics that he still does have a screen presence. The National Film Award winning director made his adult career debut with A Gale Lagja in 1994, where he was paired with Urmila Matonkar. His second film was Papa Kehte Hai in 1995 opposite Mayuri Congo. After his breakthrough role in 2000 in Mohabate, he played minor Very similar eyes to Rithik. Like Salam Namaste, and Aja Nachle. The actor made his child acting debut in Masoom in 1982. Yeah, his and eyes are... Also appeared as a child it's, actor in looks like child like Rithik. ...and Karma. Number six. Yeah, yes. we knew that. Devi, yeah. Another legendary actress who has featured in Tamil, Telugu, Kannad, and Hindi films from 1967 to 1997. Not only has Hashtag she gone to too us soon. that she still can charm audiences with her 2012 performance in English Winglish, she also no doubt has done that for nearly three decades. With blockbuster performances in movies like Himmatwala, she appeared in a string of commercially successful movies, Mawali, Tofa, Naya Kadam, Master Ji, 
Mr. India are just some of the movies Shri Devi started her career as a child actor Magambo. in Magambo four in Tamil with Hanivan playing the role of young Lord Murga and acted in many Tamil and Telugu movies from then on in 1975 Shri Devi debuted in Bollywood with Julie where she played younger sister to the protagonist Lakshmi Number 5 goes to oh! Oh! Did not know that. The actress mainly known for her offbeat roles and impressive performances in Bollywood movies has impressed audiences and critics throughout her career. Her adult Bollywood acting debut was in the 1992 fantasy film Chamatkar opposite Shah Rukh Khan. The actress impressed audiences over the years with commendable roles in movies like Kaun, Ek Haseena Thi, Pyar Tune Kya Kiya and Bhoot. Urmila's first role as a child artist was in 1970. I love her films that we've film seen. Karm, following minor roles in Shireen Lagu's Marathi film Zakol and Kalyug, she achieved success at the age of 9 in Shekhar Kapoor's Masoom in 1983. Oh. Number 4 goes to Kunal Khemu, the 33-year-old actor who has been away from the limelight most of his I don't know who that is, do you? No, but he's with Saif Ali Khan and uh... He's definitely a stellar performer in his movies. His adult debut in 2005 was with Kalyug and he left a very good impression with audiences impressing cinema lovers and critics thereafter with movies such as Traffic Signal 99 and Superstar What a lot of people I don't think we've know seen any of his Kunal work was actually a child actor in the 90s featuring in his first movie Sir in 1993 followed by a string of appearances as a child star in movies like Raja Hindustani Tamanna and Bhai Number 3 goes Yeah, it's not a surprise. Kapoor. The legendary actor left all hearts melting when he made his adult debut in 1973 with Bobby opposite Dimple Kapadia. One of the most successful actors from the Kapoor family, Rishi Kapoor stars in movies even today and still keeps audiences captivated. His most noteworthy performances at his prime include Leela Majnu, Kars, Prem Rog and Bol Radha Bol. Little known fact is that Rishi Kapoor made his screen debut as a child artist in 1955 in the song Pyar Hua Ikrar Hua in the movie Shri 420 and also made an appearance in the 1970 Mera Naam Joker where he played young Raju. Number 2 goes to Alia Bhatt. The 20 year old actress has basically cemented her career in Bollywood as an A list leading lady. She made her acting debut with Student of the Year in 2012. and since then has never looked back with outstanding performances in movies like highway kapoor and sons urta punjab and dear zindagi a little known fact is that the actress actually made her first movie appearance in 1999 in the movie sangharsh where she played the young reet obroy the older version was played by preeti zinta for huh. discuss the number one position, how old is she she 30 30 30 just turned she's just a year younger than i am Amir Khan. Oh, he's an honorable mention. Hmm. The protein that growing children need. I'm a pop dad boy. I'm a pop dad boy. Need plant food. Yeah, Shahid, he'd be in there, right? Number 1 goes to Hrithik Roshan, the Greek god of Bollywood who has left audiences jaws drop with his perfect chisel look, superb dancing skills and praise He's not a dancer. Skills. Made his adult acting debut with Kahona Pathe. That's a joke. He said it himself. Over the years, Hrithik has only impressed in Bollywood with amazing performances in Koi Mil Gaya, Jodha Akbar. If we get the chance to talk to him, I really want to talk about that particular statement. The actor actually made his screen debut as a child artist. J Om Prakash, known producer and Hrithik's grandfather, first brought Roshan on screen at the age of 6 in the film Aasha. Roshan followed this with uncredited appearances in family film projects, including his father's production Aapke Deewane, Aas Paas and Bhagwan Dada. And that was the list guys. Write it down in the comments below if there were some actors that we missed out on. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. The handle is right in front of you. Follow me at Jammy Pants Four. Don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe to our channel for weekly content ahead. Thank you so much for watching. Yeah, there are a few in there we yeah, don't few, know. I don't even know some of the actors. Yeah, in there. Uh, obviously, <laughs> four years into it, we're still uh, well. Yeah, idiots. And, and some of some of them, he said, are admittedly 
they're no longer really working mm -hmm. at all. So there wouldn't be much for us to see other than stuff from the past yeah. um, in some way. But not cool video. A couple of those weren't weren't a surprise. No, no, no. At yeah, all. I mean, I mean, it'd probably be a surprise to people that don't react to stuff every single day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. There would have been a day that all of that would have surprised us, uh, obviously. Rithic? Yeah. Rithic? Shush, Shin? Debbie. Um, oh, so, I don't know if you saw this. Um, Renvier was named, not that he was in this video, um, the highest brand value of any Indian celebrity. Highest brand value. We just watched a video where he wasn't even included not the in the biggest not, maker not, earners. Not the highest grossing, but in terms of what his brand is worth. That would make me mad. Yeah. If my, if people told me, for example, I had an but eighteen it, it, million dollar net worth. But it was just last year too, though. Okay. It was yeah, just last I'm just year. I'm pulling legs. Twenty twenty two. That does not surprise. With all me. of his ads and yeah. brand deals and three films last year. Yeah. Um, I think it was 182 million. That's why I expected and to Virat, see him in that video. Virat Kohli was 180 million. So <laughs> he's in Virat Kohli territory. Well, at least last year he was. That's Whoa. what the brand value that it was. Shah Rukh Khan was like tenth at like 50 million. Who did this? I don't know. It was just something I saw on Twitter. Um, yeah, but it was just la that statement right there no, just made me not believe. What no, it was just last year. It's, so it doesn't th matter. This year, you mean to tell me, Runveer, it's it's annual. Or lifetime brand value, because if I was going to bet money, there's no way no. Runveer has higher brand value than Shah Rukh Khan. Just last year, ever? No, it's just it's taking what they did last year yeah. and what they basically made or is worth from last, last year. Last year specifically. Okay. Um, obviously, this okay. year it would obviously be Shah Rukh Khan. Pa okay. Khan. <laughs> yeah, because but even even still, that's kind of a little bit hard for me. Shah Rukh Khan didn't have anything last year. He was at fifty. <laughs> I know, yeah, but doesn't that's my point. Does that matter? Anyway, I, yeah. no, it doesn't. But I was just—I thought wait, it was an wait, interesting thing. You heard it on Twitter. It, it was that they posted the article on Twitter. It wasn't an actual uh, Twitter thing. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> um, anyways, I just thought that was interesting because it is Bollywood. interesting. Um, yeah, another good video. Um, are there? If there are other ones, please let us know what they are. Uh, oh, and. Uh, I don't know about the Indian film industry. I can only speak about Hollywood in terms of child actors. And not all child actors get screwed up by the industry at all. Um, I'm one of those people. My my buddy Scott's one of those people. There's a lot of people who grew up in the industry. And uh, it, it really matters child to child, parent to parent. And bottom line is you really ought not tell anybody whether they should or should not let their kid be in the industry. That's up to the parent and the kid. Also, your, your experience back in the 50s? Uh, yeah, no, would be different than obviously a child yeah, actors no. now. There's a lot more laws now, and, and yeah, and things in place. And and the other big game changer than even in the '90s, because obviously yeah. all those child actors. The in big the, 90s. the big game changer these days is twofold. One, and they're linked. The amount of social media, yeah, incorporation into your life, and paparazzi. Yeah, yeah. For sure. Uh, I, yeah. that's a whole other ball of Same wax. Insane, right? Yeah. Anyways, another good video. Let us know what other videos we can react to down below.